This is um uh, right now. Oh, okay. No, no, no. Stay here. Uh, this is a um better take of the elevator at um. Um, this is better take of the elevator here at 198 Ellen Hill Road, King of Prussia, PA. It's right across the street from the pavilion at King of Prussia. It's sort of, it's like uh, next door to the, um, sort of next door to the Rochester Big and Tall and the Courtside Square Shopping Center. Let's get a quick cab view. It's uh, basic, a little bit crappy um, cab. It's better tape because I don't know what brand it is. And you might help me find it. Uh, it won't say it on here, but it's a passenger, of course. It doesn't say hydraulic versus. Um, Anything. Oh, it broke somewhat recently, um, about uh, two months ago. Pe capacity is 2,000 pounds. Let's go up again. I don't know if it's traction or hydraulic either, so can you comment on that too? I know that Delgado, you want to see the um, interlock, so I'll show you that when we get up to four. Well, it doesn't have enough light on four. Show it like well. Let's see. No, not enough light. Well, there a light switch. There's a light switch. I'm not gonna hit it. I'll just get an, another one on G. I'm not sure what it could be. It could be a slower traction. Gee. Um, here's your interlock. I don't know what that could be. Um, I'm gonna read you what it says. I can't see what it says. It just says type MO 230V2A. And I don't know, some sensor bar everything else, the fixtures, or some kind of EPCO, um, I'm guessing like EPCO Classic or something, uh, I'll look on EPCO's website, but wait, there we go, I got the bell to not ring, but the lantern to light up, so I guess that's it, let it close, and that is it.